On this video, I want to share with you why every real estate agent needs to have one of these, a money bag. share with you an awesome sales tool that I've used for many many years now uh, and I call it the money bag and I can't take credit for it I have to give credit where credits due and that's to uh, a great national sales trainer by the name of Jack Daly and uh, Jack uh, trained salespeople all over the country and he shared this uh, money bag with me because he said all the salespeople that he had that have ever used this bag including himself uh, made a lot of money from it and basically what he talked about is technology. Technology uh, is good and bad. And I think with communication and also with follow-up, um, you know, people are starting to text, they're doing more emails. They got away from the traditional follow-up. Uh, people just don't write personal notes anymore. So Jack said it made a huge difference uh, with salespeople and getting to know people because let's face it, at the end of the day, people will do business with who they know, like, and trust. And uh, one of the ways that he said is by writing an actual personal note. So I want to share with you what's in this bag and I want to share a quick story with you on how it worked for us a few weeks ago. Uh, and again, I could share many, many stories with you. But in this bag, I want to show you that I already have a personal one already go. It has a stamp on it already, it has a return uh, address on it, and it has uh, the envelope inside, brand real estate group, has my business card already on it. All I have to do is just write that note and stick it in the mail and address it obviously to them. Uh, but it's already there. In there, I'll have things like uh, Starbucks cards, I'll have Dunkin' Donut coffee cards, uh, I have scratch-offs, birthday scratch-offs, uh, all different things that I have in there that I can send to them. And I also have a pen already, I have a ballpoint pen, and also have a felt-tip pen that I actually write the note in. Uh, but I do the ballpoint pen on the outside because I don't want it to smudge in case it gets wet or it rains. So you want to make sure you have that, trial and error. And uh, I have some business cards in there, and then I have these little post-it notes as well. Uh, that people really like little sticky post-it notes. But, so let me share this story with you because I think it's awesome. So uh, a couple weeks ago, one of my agents got called into the listing appointment and the seller said that they're gonna be interviewing five realtors and she was one of the five. And she asked me to go with her. So I went with her, uh, we went to the property, we went through the whole 14 step listing process and uh, I took a lot of great notes, including the seller's two kids that were there, the two beautiful daughters, five and seven. And they mentioned during the interview that they loved ice cream. And they were just such good kids throughout the interview. I mean, you know how it is as, as real estate agents, some of these kids could just destroy a whole presentation. Uh, but they were very good. They were on the couch, they were watching TV, just really, really good kids. So I took down their names from their bedroom, so I had the correct spelling. And um, my agent and I get in the car and I whip out my money bag. And I said, I gotta fill this out, I got something to do. And I went down to the local ice cream store, uh, Stewart's we call it here in our area, and uh, that's the ice cream that they love. And I got two certificates for two ice cream cones. And I wrote the seller note and I just said, thank you for so much for the opportunity to uh, take a look at your home and to consider Miranda Real Estate Group uh, as one of the actual uh, listing people or I'm sure uh, listing agents to take uh, on your property. Uh, but I also want you to give these two certificates to your daughters who are just so awesome at the appointment and really behave very well. You should be proud of them. Uh, I put that right in the mail to him and I knew he was going to take a few days to make uh, his decision. Uh, he called a couple days later to say we actually won uh, over the other four brokers and that we were going to be listing his property. And I asked him, I said, you know, what are the two or three things that you can um, share with us that made the difference of you working with Brandon Real Estate Group versus the other agents? And he said, you know what, Well, he said, you know, they're all good companies, all good, uh, all good agents. He said, but the three things that really stick out to me is one, your listing presentation. Uh, you're able to show so much more on what you do for marketing, how you're going to get our home sold, uh, the support that we're going to receive from your company and the staff. Uh, and it just the list went on and on as far as the listing presentation. That was one. Number two, he said, your pricing strategy made sense to me. I had one agent come in very low, I had another agent come in very high because I, I don't know where they came up with that number, uh, but I thought that agent was trying to just get my list, you know, get my uh, business uh, for giving me a high price. But your pricing strategy really made sense and everything that you showed us on the other properties just made sense with us. And he said the third thing is that, he said it's just the personal touch of you actually writing a personal note and the fact that you actually took the time to go to Stewart's and give that to my kids, which by the way, they already used. 
Uh, he said, that was really nice. And my wife and I really wanted to work with a company and an agent that we were going to have really good communications with because we're relocating out of the area. And it was going to be important for us to know, like, and trust uh, that agent very well. So um, it's all because of the money bag. And I've had countless, countless, countless uh, listing appointments that I went on that I've used this over the years. And it works really great. So it's called the money bag. Definitely go get it. You can get these bags for 2 or $3 uh, at uh, Staples or Office Max. Get some personal notes in there. Get them done because, you know, if you're going to just wait to go back to your office to do it, something's going to happen, right? Uh, you're going to walk in and some fire is going to be going on and you're just not going to get to it. But if you get to it right after the appointment, uh, your success is going to be a lot greater. So hopefully you love this uh, sales tool and this tip for today. And again, if I can ever be of help to you in your real estate business, please reach out to me. Give me a call. Give me a text. Send me a personal note and I'll be more than happy to help you. So let's go get them this week and have a great week. Take care.